Hi guys, have another MSM video for you today. People have asked me, I've gotten a few questions on how do I take MSM? Well, I take MSM, well, what do I take it for? I take MSM for whenever I'm doing exfoliating, I'm doing any type of skin maintenance. Yes, I, I was suffering from keratosis pylorus when you have the little spots here, so I exfoliate. At one point in the past, I used to do like stretch mark scrubs and I know that's TMI, but I like stuff like that. But I wanted to make sure that I had the proper nutrients within my system. I also had a scalp issue and I wanted to make sure that I had the proper minerals, nutrients, and so I started taking MSM. I stopped, it comes, it goes back and forth. But um, since I'm on this, oh, let's rejuvenate the skin again. I'm like, all right, let's whip the MSM back out of the cupboard. All right. How does this work? MSM, any type of any type of vitamins, minerals, or anything that you take, it's gonna take a while to show up. The effects is gonna take a while to show up in your skin, hair, and nails. Reason being is that if you have any nutritional deficiencies within your system, these nutrients go to that first. Your hair, your skin, your nails get it last. They get the surplus. Now, when you start taking any type of supplement, you just can't take it and still have a trashy diet. You have to eat clean. Everybody's definition of clean is different. My definition is nutrient dense food that nourish the body. Uh, chips don't go in there. Candy don't go in there. Soda does not go in there. White flour does not go in there. A whole bunch of cheese, milk, dairy products, they don't go in there. Um, it's kind of iffy. Clean eating means a lot of fresh fruits, vegetables. If you're going to eat meat, if you're a meat eater, it's lean meats. Nutrient-dense food. And to be honest, nutrient-dense food have the tendency to fall in the vegetable kingdom. Just saying. Anyway. Now, okay, on the package it says take one-fourth a teaspoon twice a day. One-fourth a teaspoon twice a day. My max, one fourth a teaspoon is a thousand milligrams. My max dosage, once I start working towards my max dosage, is 3,000 milligrams a day. Do you start off taking 3,000 milligrams a day? No, you do not. You start off with the one fourth a teaspoon, as I said before, is 1,000 milligrams, so that's 2,000 milligrams a day. So in the morning, I would take one fourth a teaspoon with a citrus beverage, and then I take one tablet of a thousand milligrams of vitamin C. In my research, vitamin C has a synergistic effect or it has a, it's a synergistic effect with the MSM. You can't just start popping pills and taking things like that and think everything's going to work miraculously. Sometimes some of these minerals or vitamins that you're taking work better in conjunction with another type of mineral or vitamin. So do your due diligence, do your research, and figure out what works with what. So I take that in the morning, and I take that in the morning, especially if I'm reintroducing it back into my system, I take that in the morning for about a week, week and a half, okay? Then I take the second dosage. So for a week, week and a half, I take just one dosage. That's one fourth a teaspoon. Mind you, the, the packaging says twice a day. So I don't start doing twice a day until like week two or week three, a week and a half, two weeks. And I also take that with a citrus beverage. It's either grapefruit juice, uh, lemonade, or um, orange juice. I take it with a citrus juice beverage and I take another 1000 milligram tablet of vitamin C. You have to drink a lot of water. Now as I'm working up to 3000 milligram that's probably after three weeks to four week in and then I keep it at that dosage and how that works is I take the third dosage and I split it in half. So in the morning it will be one fourth of a teaspoon plus one eighth of a teaspoon and in the, that's, did I say evening or morning? <laughs> and in the, in, listen, just split the dosage, it, just split the three doses, that third dosage, just split it in half. So then you're going to take half of it in the morning with your regular one-fourth a teaspoon, and you take the other one in the evening with your other one-fourth a teaspoon. And that's it. Citrus beverage and vitamin C. You trust your beauty <laughs> and own it. That's it.
Peace.